Hey, Lee Harder, Times a Democrat on a Monday, coming to you a little later than normal today. Um, actually, some things beyond our Monday morning print paper and online. Um, Shane Beamer has been introduced formally as South Carolina's new football coach, which you'll find stuff online right now breaking on that and some interesting things to know about the new coach. And apparently there's going to be some availability tomorrow for reporters to talk with his father and Frank Beamer, the legendary Virginia Tech coach. So that'll all be looking at the tnd.com tomorrow. But anyway, today's headlines, um, we told you today about South Carolina State University's um, effort to meet strategic goals. We also looked at test scores and performance in the Orangeburg County School District, which of course today went back to virtual uh, learning amid a pretty much what they're describing as a, um, a real problem with coronavirus. Uh, we also have a headline today that noting that Voorhees raised $1 million on last week's Giving Tuesday. Uh, that's, quite a, that's quite a feat. And uh, of course, uh, the USC women's basketball team, um, after losing a game last week for the first time in a long time, uh, actually rebounded and beat the number 23 Ohio State, uh, excuse me, Iowa State team uh, in a Sunday game. And the Clemson women also are doing quite well. They have won their first five games and opener, the opener's first five games before heading into ACC play. Of course, Monday's uh, print edition in, and online includes Farm News, uh, our weekly farm page, which we're proud to say we continue to, um, let's just say, be the um, media outlet that really pays a lot of attention to agriculture because it's absolutely huge in this state and definitely huge in Orangeburg County. All right. Thank you. Have a good evening and I will talk to you on Tuesday.